we've got the radiator valve here which we need to fit in here to the radiator so the radiator valve consists of two parts this part has got some rubber here and we need to fit it into the radiator so now to apply the plumbing tape if we're gonna turn it right so we need to apply the tape on the to the left side so when we screw it it's not gonna remove the, the tape is not gonna come off so basically the the thread we're gonna screw in this way and the tape we apply in this way so the most difficult is just to start But when you start, you see this is very easy. Because this will be enough for the radiator. So this was pretty easy. But now we need to fit this bit into the radiator. So how to do it? You can use key like this, but bigger size. I don't have anything like this. So the best thing is multi-key like this made by Rotten Rottenberger. So this is like multiple sizes you can fit, not just for the radiators for but for many other things. So whatever size it is, it's gonna fit here. So this should be enough for the radiator. So now we need to fit the actual valve onto this. So what we do we just tighten this bolt. At the end, we need we use spanner. Okay, there is I can do when the radiator is on the wall. So I've got this pack of brackets that comes with the radiator. This is for fixing the radiator to the wall, and these brackets are just this is going into here.
this going on top of this First I need to cut the copper pipes. So I need to measure where to cut. Basically my radiator will be up to here. So I need to so the pipe is gonna come into valves into the valve up to here. So I need to mark it. I need to cut it in here. The same. Fifteen mil pipes, so I use fifteen mil cutter for this. So now I need to mark where to drill for the brackets. So I'm putting the radiator onto my pipes. fix the bracket. So we've got washer, we've got our screw, we've got the bracket. Now I'm gonna fix it.
So now we need to tighten the valve. I prefer to tighten this one first. It's got olive and nothing else. You don't put any tape, anything. You just need to tighten it. Also, there's a rubber washer in it, so you just tighten it. No tape, anything. The same this one. We've got the plastic brackets as well, plastic plates. So you just put it in here. Be careful, do it gently because it's plastic, it can easily break. So just like a, this is a cover, so it looks nice. And now, in here, as you see, we've got a pre drilled hole. And also, in the set, there was a tiny screw. So, you need to put in each bracket this screw like this.